Jimmy Mook! Welcome into another quick Rippin with Mark Rippin. Today we've got, how about something modern for you guys? We've got a Prestige, this is 2023 Prestige Mark Rippin, and this is a numbered 292 out of 299 Mark Rippin. So we got a, we got a special one, we got a, a numbered Mark Rippin, that's the blue parallel on the... Uh, on the 2023 prestige uh extra points or whatever but uh yeah you can kind of see his name in there it's done in the in the blue as well so it's like a little bit difficult to see oh there it is right there yeah yeah but yeah we got mark Rippin. he's ready to rock he's ready to roll and he's ready to see what we have today which is 2023 goodwin champions so um if you all know me i've mentioned it before it was my first episode that i ever did on this channel i love uh metal universe champions and uh so this is like the supper deck so this is like the i guess the tops equivalent to, to or at least their answer to uh metal universe champions and i know goodwin champions has been around for a while but uh on this one specifically we're looking to see if hopefully we get an autograph so you got a little mix of uh uh some like some of the big star vets like obviously like tiger woods you got your michael jordans that are probably in here just like uh, metal universe and uh then you got up and comers and stuff. So you got Jackson Holiday, who's already on a team now. And then you got another uh, up and comer, Kevin Williams, of course. So it's 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 a mix of a little bit of everything. You got young stars that are going to be coming in to become pros. You got uh, the uh, you got you got uh, already existing stars. You got really random sports sometimes. Like I said, surfers. I think there was in Clear Uni or Metal Universe. There was like I don't know what was that like Taekwondo people or something or something crazy. But we get five cards per pack, eight eight cards per box. There's the Manouche for uh, a bunch of random stuff. Splash of Color. There's Upper Deck cards in here, which uh, I think it's the Upper Deck Young Guns and stuff you can get out of here. Uh, um, all, all kinds of random stuff. And then, of course, we got a shot for an auto. I'm not too. I'm not as familiar with this set as I am for um, as I am with uh, Metal Universe. This is my first time opening this one. So, and then you get a bonus pack on here, which I think is hilarious that they say this is exclusive bonus pack, even though it's printed on as part of the box so it's like it's coming off the line like that so okay but um i don't remember if this pack is we're, we'll save it for like second to last because i think it's just base cards i don't think there's anything special in it but let's go ahead and get started with these uh goodwin champions um i don't know we'll see what we get i'm kind of i don't i'm a little going into this a little blind like you guys are so i don't um I mean, I've seen them before, but, you know, I'm, I'm really just got this so I could check it out because I love Metal Universe so much. And uh, also to see if we pull a, an auto. So um, let's see what we get. We've got, so we started off with uh, Kayla, Kayla Williams on uh, uh, Ricky Bass. It looks like, oh, we got a Young Guns card already. We got ourselves an upper deck Young Guns of Drew Jones. That's not bad at all. Man, that's a thick card. Ooh, that's weird. That feels like really thick card but i'll take a young guns drew jones that's not bad at all uh, i believe that is drew jones son of andrew jones who i believe is already on a team this year but or for this season which is weird because these are 2023 i don't know but uh let's see next we got uh, julian phillips um and looks like some kind of green parallel um that is yeah rainbow neon green that one's nice that's nice so Cool, cool card. That's pretty slick. I like the quality of these, or at least of the inserts and the special cards. The base cards feel a little cheap. They feel like, like kind of almost like lower level, lower tier stuff. But got ourselves a Tiger Woods there, um, and we got a Caleb Williams. So I think if you had to compare base to Metal Universe, Metal Universe wins by a mile because these base feel really. This is like a cheap card stock. I almost feel like sage or something like that like they're just they're not impressive but uh the inserts and like the special cards are definitely the parallels and stuff are really nice but i don't know let's see what we get let's keep it rolling we'll see what we'll see what else we get so we get a Jaden bradley there's a ken griffey there ken griffey jr there's uh we got an mj all right and that looks like it's in some kind of uh upper deck parallel that's cool that's a nice one. That's a little bit. That one's got a, a gloss to it. So we'll uh, we'll sleeve up an MJ. And I'm gonna actually I'm gonna put that one up for now until we maybe get something else. Got a JJ Taylor for basketball, and we'll finish that pack with a, a Iga Swiatek for tennis. Cool. All right. 
And I don't know if we get any numbered cards. I don't remember seeing anything that was um, numbered in this stuff. So I don't know if you're going to get any numbered cards, but I think it's really just hoping for an auto. So, all right, we got a Jimmy Connor, <laughs> random Jimmy Connors, but with the great salad, though. Um, that one's I'm putting aside just because of the salad. That's some, that's some, he is rocking it in that one, man. All right, so we got a Tyrese Proctor for basketball. There's a Will Anderson Jr. That's the splash of color parallels, or uh, inserts. So those are pretty cool. Uh, there's a Will Anderson Jr. who had a great uh, rookie season for the Texans, uh, Defensive Rookie of the Year. So that's that one's a nice one to keep to hang on to. All right, Ernest Uday Jr. And we'll finish it off with uh, Sydney McLaughlin Larone of track and doing track and field. I guess we'll see. Hopefully, see her in the Olympics coming up here soon. Cool. All right. Next pack. And let's let's uh. I don't know. Let's hope for an auto. Hopefully we get one. I don't know. I guess we'll find out. All right, Carissa Moore. There's what I was talking about surfing. So we got a surfer. We've got uh, who's that there? Anthony Richardson for uh, football on the base. Um, there's a Sharapova. All right, that's not bad. And an upper deck card. And a nice the uh, I don't know what they're calling these. Yeah, I think these are just like the base upper deck cards. So like one in three packs. So we're gonna probably gonna get a lot of these. But a nice and a Maria Sharapova. I'll take that. All right, Lena Oberdorf, and we'll finish it off with Gabriel Moreno. Moreno. All right, let's see what we've got next. All right, we got another Michael Jordan uh, on the base. We've got, uh, let's see here, Darius Garland. Let's pull these up to the front, actually. We'll put Drayden Bradley we got. Noah Clowney, who I'm familiar with in basketball. And let's see, okay, so there's our Darius Garland, and let's see what our insert is. Got another splash of color in Anthony Black. All right, put that one off to the side. Let's see what we get next. I think so far, it's not bad. It's a cool mix, but I think just hard quality-wise, I think I'd rather go with Metal Universe Champions. Like, these just do not feel like they didn't do anything special like these aren't even glossy or anything so i don't know it's it's interesting oh there's a cj stroud i even though it's on a base that'd be nice to get her uh get him uh get him something of his in like a parallel or some kind of insert that'd be cool uh michaela williams who uh they i think with the lsu i think they just lost uh in the uh, elite eight but uh she's in a good up-and-comer all right, we got a Tamar Johnson for baseball and Will Anderson Jr. again on the base. And our upper deck is going to be Kajani Wright, who I'm not sure if he got drafted or where he got, went to. So I'll put him off to the side. I don't know. What do you guys think? Should we try our special pack? Because I thought I read somewhere that the special pack is just base cards. So it's like, why even open it if it's just, or why even put it in there if it's just base cards? But it looks like we did get something out of there. So we'll, uh, yeah, I don't know. Maybe we'll save that one. Let's see what we get it. Let's open that one. All right, so we've got, let's pull these guys forward. And we get a Dylan Cruz and Elijah Green. We got an Ernie Johnson from uh, TNT. And, and uh, Jordan Walsh is a rook, and looks like we got another splash of color, which is going to, ooh, going to be a Caleb Williams. All right, I'll take that. I'll take a Caleb Williams splash of color. I would like to have gotten like something, something insert wise, like really nicer insert wise of a Caleb Williams. That would have been cool, but we'll put that one aside. That's not bad. All right, and then our special pack. These look like actually do look like like some kind of alternate because they're a different color than the, they're more of a turquoise than the sky blue. So we've got another Elijah Green, a Tiger Woods. There's a Caleb Williams on the base. JJ Taylor, and it looks like our special card is going to be an all-world Andre Stoyakovich. So uh, Stoyakovich, I'm familiar with. He's the son of uh, Peja. If you're familiar with that, if you know your basketball, I yeah, I believe he's the son of Peja. I don't remember where he played this year. Um, I really can't remember. I'm blanking on where he went to school. Cool. All right, that's a cool um, that's a cool insert or a cool parallel or whatever it is to get. Um, I like that. 
So we'll put that one off to the side. I mean, we got some good stuff. These weren't bad. I just wanted to crack one open and see what we got. We got our Will Anderson. We got a cool Michael Jordan in the upper deck. Mary Shevkova. Um, so not some bad stuff. We got this um, really cool uh, green parallel of uh, Julian Phillips. Or, I'm sorry, rainbow neon green, they, they call it on the back. Got ourselves a Caleb Williams Sebastian of Color. I'll take that. And then uh, and then Young Guns. Um, I can't ask for anything more than to pull a Young Guns. That's cool. So I'll take a Young Guns of Drew Jones. That's awesome. But yeah, and then our, of course our Andre. I think, I don't know, I think personally I would rather take like Metal Universe Champions over this stuff. I mean, these are pretty cool. There's some cool, definitely some cool uh, inserts in here, but just the base cards alone, I feel, I feel like just not necessarily have more value with, with Metal Universe, but they're, I don't know, they're just better quality. So they make like collecting them a lot more fun, but um cool uh i don't know let me know what you guys thought um thanks for watching and uh be sure to check out the next one